The littlest Bergman relies on a 200cc plant to generate the fun, er, I mean power. Said power clocks in at a claimed 18.1 horsepower at 8,000 revolutions per minute with 12.5 pound-feet of torque that comes on fully by 6 grand. That gives the Bergman a 60 plus mph top speed, individual results may vary, with a decent roll-on to help you pass and get out of your own way, even on the highway, though I think I'd stay off the interstate with this scoot, personally. On paper, this mill would seem a little small for many areas within the American infrastructure, but the performance profile is such that it challenges that preconception. The liquid-cooled thumper runs SOHC to time the 4 poppet valve train with an electronic fuel injection system to sip the fuel and contribute to the 65 mile per gallon approximate mileage rating as well help with the emissions compliance. Suzuki's idle speed control helps to start a slightly cold-natured engine and stabilize the idle so you don't die out at a light, and that's great cause let's face it, that can be both dangerous and embarrassing. A thermostat-controlled cooling fan kicks on and off as needed to help deal with the waste heat, even in slow-moving nightmares, er, I mean traffic jams. Yeah, that's the ticket. Unlike its 650 sibling, the 200 rocks a standard CVT that uses variable pulleys and a special belt to keep the engine within its useful power band with no power modes or push-button shifter options. Yeah, it still provides the expected twist and go operation, but is plain vanilla by comparison. Oh well, maybe next year. You get all this for $4,999 MSRP in a tasteful titanium silver finish. The Bergman 200 ABS also comes with a 12-month limited warranty, and if Suzuki follows its usual practices, an extended warranty program should be available as an option.